Oh, my pin. Ah. Today is June 6th, June 5th. Great. June 5th. So I want to get started on unloading these three loads. So we got one right here, one right there, and there's one behind me that you can't, you can't see. This could be the last three loads, I don't know. I think I think we have three more or two more after this. My grandpa's, I mean, my dad's over with the chopper sharpening the knives. From what I heard. We got, so we got that field, that field, that field, and there's a field over there. Dad was working on yesterday. And pretty much this should be it for chopping at least. Good and we'll move around bailing and whatnot. Oh, I'll right, we'll see you guys at the farm. Ah, see the fertilizer guy behind me. Not sure if he's coming this way or not. And we're gonna find out, so. We haven't got any rain in like, I don't even remember how long. It's been quite a while since we got rain. And we're gonna go here and we're gonna get fertilizer guy. We're gonna go into first gear. Drop off up here. Maybe. I don't know. I never know what the plan is. I'm going to get. I got a thing I do at this trailer. I didn't have to turn off the trailer for yet. Oh, yeah. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine and a half. Probably have three more loads left, but yeah, then I'll for today whatever hay we have left, we're just going to break it and bail it this afternoon. Hopefully. This one's a hard one. Hang on. You guys are gonna have to watch me. I don't know why. That one holds up a lot hotter than everybody else. So. And yet again. Watch me fail. either Let's see if I can get out yep that's all I have it if I can't then now just 
I would just backed up, and I had not been, I'm not terrible at backing up, but I ain't good at it either. Let's go get to the next load. Cool story about last night. I was milking cows, and then I had to get the bulls in to, or at least, yeah, the bull, bulls in, I guess, to scrape the lot and the bunk and whatnot. And one of them is exactly not the nicest. So I just told my brother just to watch the door. And then, so I went to check the fence and I had to grab all the cows to do that. And the next thing I know, I see, here's a kind of the thing that I shouldn't have done is, I should have told my brother to wait it, wait, and wait till I say, you know, let the door open. And he was walking back to the parlor. The next thing you know, you see the bulls running at him. The whole, our Holstein bull, he's okay. I just, I literally yelled at him and scared him off and whatnot. He's, he's not here anymore. He's probably, I know it's hard to he's, say that, but when you have a killer bull on the farm, not exactly the greatest idea to keep it.
not sure what I'm gonna do. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm gonna look at her man or what. Put her in neutral. Put her in first. And here. Here. I'm not sure where to put it though. I think Grandpa's just focusing working on that field right now. That's fully bone dry. Yeah, it's kind of me though. There's a man, the myth, the legend, Grandpa. Uh, that load should do it. Not this one, but that one. Pick this up and go down to the back of the farm, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna to do it. This I'm gonna go with this stop it. With the last load, I make sure I'm not in AD. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Back to the farm. Yeah, I probably, probably put the second thing in there, buddy. Nice hay, though. Still looks pretty nice for a day old. And by the way, what I mean that, it usually takes about a day and a half to dry. And right now, it's so dry. It is actually taking about probably 12 hours for that to dry. Well, I found that pretty interesting. I don't have much. Left the rake after this. And put her in. Voila! Forget the last box. Alright. And I have this in any gear, so we're going to do this. I'm gonna go, I may as well grab the rake after this, grease it. That way it'll be all rigged for if they want to bail it. Not, there's not much rake anyway, it's like 10 minutes of rake and I'm done, so not the end of the world. And I find dad fertilizing, so I'm not sure where he is. You ever still have some down here yet? Maybe, no, maybe he doesn't. I don't know. It is what it is, I guess. No idea what dad's doing. Miss something over there? Or... That's gonna grab the last bit of the hay. And I'm gonna continue unloading. Even though we have four or five slots and it takes three. Dad said it'll just beat off the front. And then he'll, uh, I'm trying to think what I'm trying to think. And I can't think. Oh yeah, this should definitely be interesting. Yeah, that's got one and a half loads left and I'll, I'll be done chopping hay for the rest of the year. And my dad, and he's gonna shut the check. I'm getting close to done with this load. Which way are you gonna go, Dad? Which way are you gonna go? I'm guessing that way. Voila! And 
there he goes. And I don't have much left of this float to be honest with you. Where my dad's going. He's got on flying a drone for a little bit. It has three rows left. Chopping 20, 23, 4 hay alleys. simple thing that I have the guy accidentally edited a video so I have to make sure tonight I have that up ready to go. Let's go and hook this. Go back inside a little bit. It is now 3 o'clock I think. on top of the hill for now. I'll probably move him back down there. Alright, I'm gonna back it up just a hair. hit that like button and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys on the next video, which who knows, who knows when at this point. Peace.